all right oh well, i think we decided where we're gonna camp this next weekend for my birthday at the tree farm there's a couple of spaces but i just wanted to walk down out to the road so you guys are probably going to be coming from this way which is monmouth um if you come from dallas or pd it'll be this way but here's what the gate looks like it'll be closed um it's real easy to miss even as the owners we miss it from time to time so we'll put up the banner on the sign on the gate for you guys but um we're gonna take the rig back up here a little ways but right beyond this little section a little timber right here um there's a meadow back there uh, you can kind of see it opens up a little bit right here and then just on the other side so we're gonna bring the rig up over here and we're gonna cut a pathway so that we can come in through the gate here and then hook left and we should be able to get the rigs back in over there this area is real marshy and right when we come in it's pretty marshy so um yeah we'll see how it goes but anyway i think we got a solid game plan of what we're gonna do and then there's some other spaces up the hill up down on the other side of the property that maybe we could use in the future but i'll wait till everybody's here and we'll kind of show you guys that and if you guys want to help me clean those out so we can use those later then maybe we'll do that this next weekend and i don't know i'm not really going to make much big plans i just kind of want to come out here and enjoy the quiet uh have a fire enjoy the property and this is where dash is buried this is where memorial for cousin max is and so it's Something that got left for from Great Grandpa Guyland for us to use, and so anyway. Can I fix it? Yeah, it's in there. We're gonna back up and do something oh, yeah. here for a little bit. I forgot. We're gonna back up. Yeah. Okay, we're backing up now. Okay. See you later. We're out here at the tree farm, trying to figure out where we're all gonna camp at. Figure I'd give a little video walk around. So we're at the very far end of the property. There's Tess over there. We're just gonna walk around thinking. Um, this space over here, it's kind of sloped and open, um, but this is actually, there's an orange marker. This is the neighbor's property, so we're trying to figure out if we can get everybody in this. If it's too sloped right here, there's a couple more spaces down yonder. And this is right where Dash is buried here underneath this tree, so it's pretty sentimental to us. Deep fixed. Good again. All right. We'll go kind of back up so the property kind of goes uphill and then back down, and we're all the way on the back corner of it. And so, up there in the middle, kind of there's a landing where you pull timber from this side or the other side of the property, and then down at the bottom, there's another maybe potential spot. So, we'll go look and just kind of show you what we're up against. some brushwork for the weekend. So here's a gate. There's a road. You're gonna come in, please. Close the gate behind you. And then you'll come in here. There's a little wood pile right here on your right. And just past the wood pile. You'll see a little opening right here on the left between these two trees. So try not to get stuck or too, too much tire spinning, but we're going to bring you all in here. Which way you want me to go, babe? Yeah, go that way. Okay. I'll come over here to the right. Stay away from the bendy tree. Yeah. Stay away from the bendy tree, and then we'll come over yonder. Uh, 
should be able to get you stopped between these two trees right here. And then there's another meadow that we'll use for fire. I think maybe when you come through these two tiny trees, you can cut it more driver and come this way and leave more space back there. Over there on we'll side. get the weed eater and weed those weeds when we get here on Friday with Bob. Okay. And um, that'll be a good couple spots to camp all along that back area. You can mm -hmm. see your you yeah. can see your tracks. Maybe yeah. if you just cut it a little more, we'll make the right. We'll make it a little bit. Right, and then so people can back up here. <laughs> Right where you kind of oh yeah so oh, like right. if you cut in a little bit more we people can back up yeah. and go right back out right back out okay i think that's so we'll work. try to get everybody's tents and camp stuff all up in this area right here uh, and tessa said we got to clean some of this stuff out for tents and then down here, down here yeah there's some spots down here and then like underneath this big pine there's some flat spots down there and then up here um some of it's kind of marshy and lumpy, so you guys will just have to kind of decide where you want your stuff at. There's space back here, and then we'll use this meadow right here. You got a little bit of firewood cut from our burn pile. And yeah, and you guys might want to camp around the fire too. I'm cool with that, whatever you guys want to do. Um, but we'll have the main fire pit right in this area, kind of. We'll camp over yonder by the, by the bonfire pile that we may or may not light off this weekend. Um, and then yeah. And hang out right down here the gates just right there on the other side of these little small trees so we should be able to see everybody come in and kind of nice too to have the camp or the yeah. fire in the middle there's a lot of space for just bullshit tents and tents and, and whatever yeah whatever. So, you know I mean, that could be like the in and out thing. and this is part of having you guys out and i appreciate you guys rsvp in because we didn't want to make it like a huge public thing but at the same time like we want to bring people out and show but we're really apprehensive about how much of it you know so you guys can kind of help us you know see what we can make out of this thing you know it doesn't just have to sit out here and grow trees like we can <laughs> we can do use some it. stuff we can use it as long as you know as long as it's respecting the family and tessa's wishes and all that good stuff so right. feel pretty good about it got That's some work done cool. yeah and there's 30 acres here so you guys can you know take off with the kids and whatnot and there's game trail all over the place so i'm sure we'll see animal and whatnot um and we thought about maybe getting some ammo and maybe setting up a shooting pit or something but I don't know, if you guys are on the group, it's all up hill, so we can do that. yeah, and it's all up the hill. So you know, if you guys are in the group, we'll talk about it. Um, I'll throw it up on the forum or whatever. But anyway, looking forward to seeing you guys. It's gonna be a cool weekend. <clears throat>